So this year, we are working on saying no to things that do not give us joy, give us peace, give us comfort, or help us to thrive and succeed. And I'm going to share those things with you today because I think it's important we encourage each other to do better in life and have healthier outcomes in what we do. So here are some of the things we are saying no to this year. And some of these hit hard and were hard decisions to make, but they're necessary. We're saying no to things that hurt our health. Now, if you've watched any of our previous videos, you know that I'm an encourager. I want people to succeed. I want them to have joy and love and happiness in their lives. Uh, I have a lot of health issues, and I have been battling them, and I have said enough is enough. I've been on a journey to lose weight, and I am losing weight, and I am so proud of myself. And so it takes saying no to things that I know are going to harm my body, and it's not easy, but it's worth it. Now, the other thing we're saying no to this year is toxic relationships or relationships that are physically or mentally draining to us. Now, this is a very, very hard thing, and I suggest you pray, think about it, whatever it is that you need to do before you make that decision, because there is consequences to it. Sometimes they're good, and sometimes they're bad, but you know the people in your life that are soul suckers, as I call them, that just drain you and leave you feeling empty or emotionally um, a mess, we're choosing to not enrich those relationships, to still love them from afar, but to limit our interaction. And I think it's important for us and them, whoever they may be in your relationship or in mine, for me, it was a lot of work-related stuff, putting a limit on those things. Um, another thing that we're saying no to is too many things to do. Now, um, I love to be busy. It's very hard for me to just sit and do nothing, have my mind calm down, and not have plans going. But I've seen the effect of being on the go all the time, and this year we are choosing to do the opposite of that and learn to be restful and patient with people and in our home, find joy with what we have, contentedness, um, just a little bit less of being all over the place and having all the things going on. The other thing we're saying no to is the toxic um, and overwhelming culture of in order to succeed on social media that you must be posting all the time. Everything is content. We're going to share as we feel led and how we have the energy to physically, mentally, and emotionally. Um, I let my kids choose when they want to be on camera and when they don't, even though we're a family channel. And so we're going to continue to do that. They love to spit out video ideas of what we could share as a family. Um, so those are some of the things that we're going to say no to this year. And I would love to hear in the comments, what are you saying no to? What is something that you've realized this last year affected your life or your family that you don't want to affect it anymore? I would really just love, love, love to hear that. We are realizing that there's a lot of power in the word no. Of course, you don't have to say it to everything, but it's so good to choose wisely of where you're going to put your time, your money, your talents, your treasures, your energy, and all that. So that's a little bit about what we're doing this year. Please let us know in the comments some things that you plan on saying no to and think about it. Is there something that is just really, really draining you that you need to say no to? Um, I had a cutback. I worked three jobs, and I've had to pull the reins back substantially just to like not have every day be full of stress and it has been so worth it so I want to encourage you in that I think Piper's coming over to show some of her little artwork she made she a made bunny. a little clay bunny so cute she and Leilani got new glasses and they are just adorable in them <laughs> so I'll let Lonnie come over and show her glasses and she wants to oh, you want to show your clay get your little clay items too yeah let's see them Oh my gosh, it's so good. What else did you make? Oh, I love that. I like your glasses. Oh, and you made a flower too? Yeah. Reminds me of a daisy. <laughs> well, that's our bit for now. We're just enjoying the new year at a more peaceful rate. We'll see you guys next time we pop on to vlog, and we hope you guys all have a blessed 2023. Bye! Bye.